Hi, this is my reflection vlog for the persuasive speech. Um, the purpose of the speech was for me to persuade my audience why single gender schools should not even be around. Um, going into this presentation, I felt pretty confident. I did a little bit of research about this in um, high school for my um, speech and debate class, whatever you call it. Um, my anxiety, it decreased as, be, as I began my speech. It was, as I was uh, going along, it was a little, a little tense. I, I want to say I was a little bit nervous, but I got a lot better as it went on. I got a little more comfortable. My technology, it was adequately prepared. I wish my, um, there's a different setup I could think of, but this is the best one as I can think of to show my audience and show me. Um... My transitions felt a little better this time. They're lo they're rough for the informative speech, even though it wasn't in front of people. But it was still a little bit rough. Um, it was a little bit better. I, I feel like I did better this time. Um, what felt natural to me was uh, just talking about it, honestly. Um, what felt odd, it was uh, just talking in front of three people, but talking to a camera is a little bit odd, but... Um, when I cons the way I considered my audience when I was developing my speech, um, I figured there are some people who were relatively, who knew a little bit about, um, knew a little bit about my, uh, topic, the single gender schools. I feel like most of my audience didn't know much about it. They might have heard about it, but probably didn't think anything of it. I don't think it's very common around here. <laughs> um... I guess I don't know how my audience responded to my speech. My three audience members, they applauded for me, I guess. Um, let's see. What I did in my speech that worked. Um, I look sharp. Um, my note cards helped a lot. I mean, I didn't feel like I was forgetting stuff. What didn't work... Um, there was actually I take there was some stuff I was forgetting. Um, I went and looked back in my outline, and realized that I missed a little bit of stuff. But my time was fine. Um, I should read over my outline and know what I'm gonna say more before I just look at my note cards. Um, <clears throat> the chapter that I actually took a lot out of was the chapter 18 the about practicing your speech um i practiced in the mirror and that helped seemed to help a lot i felt a little more confident when i uh, practiced in the mirror i think it was page 158 is page 158 talking about uh practicing in the mirror practicing in front of your friends and family i mean that's what i did but i gave my speech to my friends and family anyway so um that is it it looks like Thanks.